online surveys. What a load of malarkey! Dropshipping. That's so 2000s. Test websites and apps. Sell photos online. Yes, if you want to make 25 cents a month. Affiliate marketing. You need a large following for affiliate marketing. Podcasts? With a 95% failure rate? No, thank you. There is so much Irish bull on the internet and here on YouTube telling us how we can make money online. In this video, let's differentiate the hogwash and the realism. The bourgeois and the actuality. The cod's wallop and the naked truth. And if you have not yet subscribed to the channel, we would greatly appreciate if you did. Let's first start with something you should not do and what you should do instead. In almost every article online about best ways to make money online, dropshipping will always be on the list. I was doing dropshipping 25 years ago and then it was oversaturated. Today, it's fossilized. What you should do instead is fulfillment by Amazon, FBA. And to those that say FBA is dead, I say that's just an excuse. I have family and close friends turning over millions with FBA, some that I've even started recently. But like everything else, you have to be creative. Be different. Sell something different. Don't be like everybody else. Don't copy what everybody else is doing because that's just dropshipping. There are literally millions of products that you can sell on Amazon. You saw some from China and from places like Alibaba. You want to be a little bit different. Let's take this quirky chair and use it as an example. I bought this at the fair I went to. It cost me, I think it was 30 pounds. You put your fingers in, you turn it, and it opens up to a full-size chair. I take this with me everywhere. I use it at my son's football to sit down. I take it with me to work, to stand on when I need to reach places I cannot reach. It's an absolute brilliant product. You want to find something different, something a little bit quirky, to be different than the rest. Number two on my list is to sell handmade products. When I hear others bring this idea up without going into too much detail, what comes to mind is knitting. Ooh. But lately, I've been putting a video together of current handmade products to sell online, and there are honestly so many kinds of things. Here is an example. This is a handma handmade resin. Uh, necklace, I actually made this myself. It is so easy to make, so easy to do. Yes, I know this is basic, here are a few more pieces that I haven't put the necklace in. I went on Amazon, I bought myself a template. This is a template, believe it or not, it's a silicon template, where you just simply pour the resin in. Well, it's not as simple as that, you gotta mix the A with a B. That's for another video, it's a little bit, uh, it's not complicated, it's actually very, very easy to do. Um, but uh, I bought this on Amazon. I bought these things, which is basically the string for the necklaces. Uh, you can mix all different colors into the resin. You can put all sorts of things into the resin. These are gold flakes. People put flowers. People put all sorts of things in them. Um, it's one of the easiest things to make. And you can make it your own and sell them online. Number three on my list is a payroll processing specialist. There are so many cheap courses you can buy and study from home to learn how payroll works. It's the kind of business that once you get a client, it's almost like a passive income. It doesn't take much time at all once everything is set up and can be done from anywhere in the world. This would especially suit somebody that wants to or can only work part-time, someone that has other commitments in their life like a single parent, or if you want, you can grow this into a full-time business. Number four on my list is matched betting. Now match betting is a great way to make some extra tax-free income online. There are virtually no risks. I've made a video on what match betting is and how it works. You can watch it here or maybe it's on this side. And I will also post a video link uh, together with a link for more information and tutorial videos about match betting in the description below. I'm trying to get this mold, this, uh, uh, this board that I made. Uh, this is resin, and this is wood, we spoke about resin before, out of this mold, and it's kind of stuck, and I think it's because um, I didn't use mold release in this. So if you have any tips on how I can get this uh, out of my mold, please let me know in the comment section below. But I gotta show you, let me see if I can come up to the camera. It's absol absolutely beautiful. Obviously this top part I'm gonna trim off, and you'll be, uh, I'll polish up the wood, it's gonna look beautiful. But check out the colors of that resin, stunning absolutely stunning and these are the kind of things that you can make at home and you can sell online there are so many products but i am going to make separate videos all about resin and all sorts of things you can make and how you can make money 
with resin. Number five on my list is to sell digital products. Now, digital products are things like file templates. For example, a file template to cut out a clock on a CNC machine. This is a clock template. And with this, I can then produce something that looks like this. Obviously, it's not finished. I still got to put the clock mechanism, mechanism, sorry, mechanism in the back, through the back. Yeah, I got to clean all that up. Um, but again, this is resin. Make clocks. Here's another one that I that I'm, I'm in the middle of making. I've got the tape at the back. I just got to sandpaper this down again. Pour a clear coat over. Put the numbers in. Put the clock mechanism mechanism in. And we have a clock worth 180 quid, which I can sell online. It only cost me about 25 all in, including the resin. Now, you won't make a lot of sales with this as it's for a very particular and for a very small market. But there are thousands of things you can make templates for, like stencil templates, digital printable products like diaries, Canva templates. Um, here's a good one. Website templates. And they go for a lot of money on websites like Etsy with very minimal work, as most of the work is done when you set up the template. There are no overhead costs, almost 100% profit margin minus fees, and you can automate sales on various platforms. There is a lot of posh and twaddle out there of digital ideas you can sell, so I'm putting together a video of realistic, money-making digital product ideas to sell and where to sell them. So make sure to press the bell icon when you subscribe so that you get notified when that video goes live. Number six on my list is course creation. Now, if you know how to do something, why not show others and make money while doing it? I do it. I sell a course on how to become a property inventory clerk you probably have no idea what that is. But a couple of years ago, I recorded the course, I sell it on Thinkific for 195 pounds, almost $250, and every so often, somebody buys it. And whenever I get a sale, this flame reignites inside me to make the course better, to market it, and to make more courses. If you're good at something, everybody is good at something. It could be arts and crafts, it could be web design, it could be how to trade the financial markets, there are thousands of ideas you can create a course for and sell on websites like Thinkific, Udemy. Do a simple search on Google for online courses and you'll find tons of websites with tools to put your course in front of the masses. And if you're interested in a business where you can make over 60,000 pounds per year here in the UK, then go check out my course on how to become an inventory clerk. It's one of the easiest businesses to set up and literally no startup costs at all. You don't need any qualifications. In a, and in my short course, I also show you in a very effective way on how to get clients for free. It's a no brainer and you'll make back your money with just one and a half jobs. The link is in the description below and I'll also pin it in the top comments so that you can easily find it. I started the last section, if you know how to do something, why not teach others? Which brings me on to the next on my list on best ways to make money online and that is to be an online tutor. Now, you probably think you can't do, be a tutor as you have to be qualified, but more often than not, you don't need to be. There are thousands of people doing this part-time and full-time, earning the same amount, and in some cases more, than qualified teachers. There are so many subjects you can teach from extra curriculum for children and young students to hardcore subjects like math, languages, etc. Again, Lots of websites online to use as a platform. Your friend is Google. Some may say the next thing on my list is dead in the water, but I can assure you it's alive and kicking. Number eight on my list on best ways to make money online is to become an SEO expert. Stands for search engine optimization. No, it's not dead. The techniques to get noticed on Google, especially for free, may have changed a little in the past 25 years. But like everything, you have to adapt. There are courses you can buy for cheap to learn and there is so much money to be made, especially with pay-per-clicks, as you charge a percentage on all ad spend. The reality is you won't succeed in everything. In fact, you'll probably fail at most things. Success is enthusiasm. You go from one failure to the next until you succeed. You cannot rise if you haven't fallen. Success and failure is like an elastic band. The further you pull the elastic band back, representing how bad you failed, the further you'll spring forward to success. You just have to make sure the band keeps going forwards. Make sure to watch this next video to learn of some of the easiest businesses to start. Thank you for watching.